Hey everyone, two announcements. First, the source code for all my machine learning videos is now out on GitHub. And second, even more exciting, I finally found a way to create standalone executables that anyone can run. So one of the reasons it took so long is that in the current state of machine learning, you basically have to be a competent programmer to run anything. Let me explain some of the steps involved to give you an idea. So I write apps in Python, which means you have to install Python and match the version correctly, and then install Keras, but you need to use the latest experimental branch, which means you have to use special git commands, and then do the same thing with Theano, which is another dependency. But to even use those, you have to have some special GPU toolkits, CUDA and QDNN, which you better have compatible hardware for, and then you have to install Pygame for the GUI and other dependencies. The list goes on, and you generally encounter problems from each of these steps if you've never done the setup before. And after all that, you still have to do the actual training. So yeah, it's pretty terrible. Here's how I managed to simplify. In order to remove the Python runtime, I wrote everything in C++, so I can just generate an executable. I swapped out Keras for Dlib, which is a C++ alternative that actually works well, but it's maintained by one guy and poorly documented and took me forever to get working correctly. The Pygame GUI was swapped out for SFML, which is a nearly identical C++ equivalent. My models are just copied over from my Python versions and embedded directly into the executable, so now it's just a single file you can run, no installations, and no messy steps required. Well, sort of. You'll still need a modern NVIDIA GPU, and the only step I couldn't get rid of is installing those GPU toolkits. CUDA is easy to install, you can just download it from NVIDIA's website. QDNN, on the other hand, is a little obnoxious. You have to create an account and fill out a survey. Once you get it though, just unzip it and copy the files to where you install CUDA. That's it. Right now, I've only ported Deep Doodle, shown in my very first video, but I'll eventually try to make standalone versions for all of them. So go out and give it a try. Once you do that GPU stuff once, you should be good for all of my future releases. Can't wait to see what people do with this, and thanks for watching.